Badu do do badu do do badu do do evil. Evil. Short stream. I just hit myself in the eye. That's embarrassing. <laughs> oh, evil, evil, evil. All right, for VOD watchers, I'm gonna just get to the point. Yada Garasu is legal, and we all knew it. And uh, look, this is my spirit deck. I haven't made a video on it, but hey, normally I just stream. Now, YouTube YouTube stream watchers don't know. But uh, Twitch stream watchers know about this deck, all right? My spirit deck, all right? We've got spirit, yes, we do. And since we're playing spirits, Yada Garasu. <laughs> I rhymed. Aha, aha. All right, hold on. Let me pull up my chats. Let me pull up my chats. But Yada Garasu is going to get play. I actually just finished a duel with this, and uh, it was pretty dirty. It was pretty dirty. I will not tell a lie. It was pretty dirty. Um, but we're going to play it now. This is going to be the first time YouTube has seen this. Twitch has definitely already seen this. Speaking of which, let me get my chats up. Let me get my chats up. Let me get my chats up. Booty boom to boom. Uh, pop out chat. Boom on Twitch. Good. And then uh, YouTube. Let's get that chat going as well. No, 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 no. Ba da boom, boom. Live. Bro, bro, fight the ball. What? Appreciate the sub, Ronnie. Thank you for the sub. Thank you for the sub. I'm just getting my stuff all set up. Boom, boom. And pop out chat. All right. All right. Hello, YouTube. Hello, Twitch. Uh, streaming something that's not that's not God of War. Oh, I got to update that on Twitch, too. Hold up. Twitch. We're not playing God of War today. We finished that DLC. I know there's more to the DLC that we could be doing, but um, felt like doing a little Yu-Gi-Oh. So let's upgrade this evil Yu-Gi-Oh card. Boom. And Master oh, Duel. Oh, Boom, boom. All right, so uh, let's get started. Let's get started. Did you guys know my goal is to hit 1 million subscribers by the end of this month? <laughs> I actually was recording some pretty fun videos. I can't wait for you guys to see them. Uh, I got a couple videos on the way being edited right now. Uh, but that's not what we're here to talk about. It's not what we're here to talk about. We are here to discuss Yadagorasu and its evilness. I want y'all to see this evil card. What up, Joten? Finally a stream I can watch because I haven't played Valhalla. Bro, play it. What's wrong with you? Uh, all right, watch this replay, everybody. Just watch what this deck did. Uh, this was right before I went live, and I was like, you know what? I got to go live and pull this off. Uh, let's get this number over here to 1 million on YouTube. Doesn't cost a penny. Appreciate you guys. All right, so watch this. Watch my opponent's board, and just watch how we just dissect them, all right? So he goes into the void, draws a card. He's just drawing cards, Dragon Tuner. He's playing uh, Dragoonity. And uh, Dragoonity just be summoning a lot. I ain't gonna lie. So let's just fast forward through his turn. He has one of those long Yu-Gi-Oh turns. You know what I mean? Those turns that just be taken forever. And you're just like, damn, man, hurry up. I'm gonna move myself, by the way. For a uh, Yu-Gi-Oh stream, I'm gonna put myself right above my life points. Uh, some, Something like that. All right, my opponent, basically, long story short, he's getting a bunch of negates set up. Uh, you know, synchro players just be taken forever. And again, we have a spirit deck. So a lot of our cards, spirit monsters, right? Uh, and again, I'm just sighing because you, you already know, man, this guy, he's just going to take a break. But we got some good board breakers in our hand. Harpy's Feather Duster evenly matched. And you're probably going to be like, all right, well, if he gets a bunch of negates, how do you beat, you know? How do you beat that? You know what I'm saying? But uh, he's basically going to end his board with uh, Barone, Borolod. No, not Barone. It's going to be Borolod and then two other. Yeah, Crystal and uh, some some other card right here. All right, so we're going to... Boom. Ends his turn right here. So his turn ends with Blow My Load Savage Dragon. All right. Borolod Savage Dragon. This card is an Omni Negate. You play a monster effect, spell effect. This guy can negate it by removing a counter. Uh, this is a monster negate. 
And this is a monster negate, okay? Big scary negates, blah, 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 okay? Comes back to my turn. Deru, I got Imperm. So what I'm immediately gonna do is we're gonna bait this guy's effect out because he is the most threatening in terms of my evenly matched, but I'm also a little afraid of his back row, which I'll take care of in a moment. First, we're gonna go infinite and permanence. The reason why we do that before harpies is obvious. You know, if I play harpies, he'll just negate it uh, with boar load. So we're just gonna force the negate with imperm. Plus we have to play imperm. Uh, we can only play it from our hand if we don't have any card on the field. So hit that. Then I play Denko Seca. Now Labyrinth players are shuddering in their little booties, knees cackling together because Denko Seca, read this effect. Uh, cannot be special summoned, which is fine. My deck does a lot of normal summons. Uh, while you control no set spells or traps, neither player can uh, activate spell or trap cards that are set on the field. So basically I effectively shut down his back row immediately. And because I, I did that just to watch out for like solemn judgment type cards, any sort of counter trap, because I figured he would have one. I play Harpies because I know it's safe to play now. Destroy the back row, just because I'm a little worried about what it was. Now I go into battle because I want to use evenly matched, but I can't control a monster. So I'm actually going to crash Denko Seca. Okay. And by the way, I did hit a counter trap. This would have been a negate for Harpy's Feather Duster. So even if he decided not to use his Boar Load, uh, he did have a negate for it. So playing Denko Seca was definitely the play right there. Okay. I crash into uh, Boar Load, get destroyed, end of battle phase, activate evenly matched. He gets rid of all these. Makes sense because this is an Omni negate. Uh, this thing can negate everything. You know what I mean? The other ones were just limited to monster effects. Cool. He keeps that on the field. And now I know it's unlikely he's going to be able to finish me off. He would need 3,700 more damage. And he only has 3,000 attack on the field. So took my chances. I'm like, all right, I think I can survive the next turn. Because if I did, and then I'm not going to lie. It took a little bit of a... Took a little bit of a Jesus draw right here. But watch what we draw. Watch what we draw. Pot of Desires. Okay. Now, it again, he has an Omni negate. He could just negate Pot of Desires unless we play a Mono Iwato, which shuts down all monster effects unless they're a spirit monster. So, basically, I just summon this card. He has no negates. So, I'm free to play Pot of Desires, banish top 10. Draw two, we get Raigeki. Oh my gosh, I'm feeling like the Pharaoh. Play Raigeki again, he can't negate it because of Amano Iwato. Destroy the field. And now I can activate Sakitama in the hand, which allows me to normal summon a spirit monster from my hand. Play Yadagorasu, and you know where this is going. Yadagorasu, if you don't know why this card was banned for so long, just in case you didn't know, most of you guys know, but in case you didn't know, this card, when it inflicts battle damage, skip the draw phase of their next turn. He has nothing. Yadagorasu lock in play in 2024, baby. Now, it's just a systematic destruction from here. He can't do anything. Yada comes back. Amano Iwato comes back. His next turn, he doesn't get to draw. Uh, and it's just, he's just in a chokehold. There's nothing he can do. Uh, I could just troll around and just play Yada. But Sakitama again, normal summon spirit, play Amano Iwato. And it's just this until the end of the game. He can't do anything. Yada lock successfully engaged. And uh, and uh, he's had about all he can take here. There's nothing he can do and he knows it. And he leaves. Dirty evil. Evil. Bro got Yada locked, baby. Yada locked in 2024, baby. And the spirit deck does a lot more than that. And I'm going to show you guys right now. Now, normally I was going to wait for a good video for this, but hey, I was like, I want to be live consistent. I want y'all to see my face consistently, especially on YouTube side. because We'll be trying to grind for this 1 million subscribers by the end of the month. So if you're not subscribed, please do me a favor and subscribe. We actually like to go second with the spirit deck. Uh, so yeah, I was like, fuck it. Let's go live. Let the people see my face. Cause sometimes I'm just sitting here cooking and like, it's not video worthy, but sometimes it's live worthy. You know what I mean? All right. I like this hand. I like this hand. 
I like this hand quite a bit, actually. I like this hand quite a bit. Let's see what he's playing. Oh, he's playing uh, Nechiria. Bro, bro, Broly Legendary, appreciate the gifted sub. Thank you, thank you. Opponent using Dragoonity was based. Yeah, he was based until he couldn't draw cards. Finally catching the best YouTuber live. Hey, appreciate the $10, Jerry, and appreciate the $4.99, Ricardo. Uh, who else did I miss? Matt Corona, appreciate the uh, 1999, and Matt Corona, appreciate the other 1999. Thank you. Bower! Ultimate Bower is what he said. And Ricardo, I think you donated twice, but thank you, bro. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. All right. Uh, he's playing Nechiria. I am not too worried about this because this card exists. I think I think he's cooked. I think he's cooked. I think it doesn't matter what he has. Like, truly, I, I don't think he can do anything. Like, this is a deadly combo. Unless he has some crazy back row. Um... Oh, it's Runic Nechiria. Oh, yeah, you're really ugly. All right, we might be in a little trouble. Depending on which Runic cards he ends up with in his hand. Did the ban list already hit? Because I know Runics are getting hit. Uh, the field spell is going to get limited to one, I want to say. So let's see. Ah, Mountain Valley Spring Water. When in doubt, lock him out. Yeah. Okay, so Verde, appreciate the prime. Syriax, I do love all your videos with the three idiots, but I love all your Yu-Gi-Oh videos. Hey, thank you, bro. Kenji, appreciate the 1999. Man, y'all paid me like an infomercial. <laughs> I appreciate the donation. Again, not necessary, but always grateful. Thank you so much. Bro dropped a woot. I haven't heard woot since runescape 2010 woot bro, bro, fight the woot runic destruction is what's going to one my bad that's what i meant the field spells at two right now right oh rune oh runic fountain's already at one she did they both get hit i want i thought runic fountain was at two but i might be crazy is this your whole turn oh you better you better hope i don't draw something nasty all right, well, he doesn't have any monster negates, but he does have, hmm. Let's see, let's see. How do I want to gear about this? All right, let's start by playing this. Unfortunately, I don't think he's going to be playing any monster negates or monster effects. Oh, here comes the monster effects. Okay, here we go. Nechiria, he's going to special summon some Nechiria garbage onto the field. Hopefully, it's a card whose effect activates when summoned. Yeah, if this card is normal or special summon. All right, we in there. We in there, baby. We in there, baby. I feel good. I'm feeling good. All right, so now we simply play the no card. Now you can't do anything. I hope you enjoyed those card effects, partner. But I need him to control a monster while I play Tactics Thrust. Uh, and I get away with it. Oh, he's cooked. He's cooked. <laughs> he's cooked. Let's go ahead and grab Harpy's Feather Duster. Let's get rid of that back row. You don't need that. You don't need that back row, partner. You don't need that back row, partner. Hey, you know what? And while you're at it, he don't really need those monsters, do we? But do I need those monsters, Math? Nah, I don't really need those monsters. Wait, that's a... Okay, yeah. I don't need those monsters. Yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and get rid of those two. I hope you don't mind, partner. <laughs> now we're gonna go ahead and triple tactics Talant. <laughs> I feel so... Vicious. Let's draw two. Let's just draw two. This also turns off Ash Blossom, by the way. Just by the way. Boom. Uh, let's follow it up with Sakitama. And I think we're just going to go into a Zeus play. Boom. Boom. Utopia. I could have just hit his hand. Honestly, maybe I should have, but 
This also, I'm protected from Nibiru too. Like, Amano Iwato is crazy. Like, you just don't get monster effects. It it works against you too if you're not, if you're playing non-spirit monsters. Like, I don't have monster effects either while it's on the field. But again, it, it returns to the hand during the end phase. Uh, so now we're going to get out. Say it with me. Say it with me. Zeus! Zeus! All right, Dr. Seuss on the field. End our turn. Amano Iwata returns to the hand. Back to you, partner. No Utopia double? Uh, no Utopia double. I just wanted Zeus with four material. I just wanted Zeus with faux material. See what he's got. Now, if he can beat that, if he can beat that, I'll be surprised. And we activated triple tactics. I mean, uh, time tearing. So we draw two every turn. Send one Nature from the deck to the graveyard. Okay. Nature. All right. What else does this thing do? If your opponent normal or special summons, you can special. Okay, so we're not going to be doing that right now. What is this doing? Add one nature area from the deck to the hand. Okay. Okay, I say. Reluctant lay. Boom, 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 boom. Mole cricket solos? Bro, ain't no mole cr cricket doing nothing, bro. Mole cricket ain't doing nothing. What are you talking about? Amano Iwata, unless he can beat me this turn somehow. Special summon from the hand or the graveyard. All right. What's in this graveyard of his? I was talking about Mole Cricket, right? Uh, during the main phase, tribute this card. Special summon one Nature monster. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Here's what we're going to do. Right when it hits the field, we're going to activate Zeus. Then if he activates his card in re response, Zeus will still um, trigger and get rid of whatever. Damn. He, he did it before me. Why was he allowed to do it before me? I thought I could do it first. But we do have a double activation, so Let's see what he brings out. Fight the bow. Oh, I could just do it in response. Hold on. Tribute this card. Special summon. One Nature monster. Okay, so he didn't have to tribute because he used that thing's effect. <laughs> or you can special summon two if your opponent controls the highest attack. Maybe I need to wait for whichever monster to come out first. Can he only do this thing once per turn? If you would tribute, send the top two, okay? You can only use each effect once per turn. Okay. So, I think I need to wait for his card to get out here first and then activate Zeus. I think. I think, but we shall see. We shall see if it was a mistake indeed. And I'm not looking at chat right now. I will lose and I will win by my own accord. Can this activate twice? No way. All right. Activate. And if I do destroy that card. Okay, so I can just, in response to the negate, I'll just activate Zeus again. I don't think he can use that twice. Oh, wait, I think he can use it twice. I should have read that. Oh, he tributed itself. That's fine. All right, let me just activate Zeus again. Clear the field. All right. All right. All right. That field getting cleared regardless, partner. You did out Zeus, but does that really save you? Does that save you? Because I don't think it does, baby. Because I don't draw one. Draw two. Oh, it's normal summon galore, baby. It's normal summon galore. Yeah. 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 I am not confined by the rules of normal summoning, for I have power. 
Next duel. See, we don't even... It, it, bro, there's so many tricks and gimmicks that this deck does, bro. I don't even... I don't even need Yada Garasu every time. Yada Garasu just a thing that I can do. Oh, shit. We playing space, Mumbo. No, we, we are not playing space, Mumbo. Unfortunately, I regret to inform. Zach McCoy, appreciate the 1999. Uh, finally catching you live. You and your content rock. Thanks. Keep it up. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Chief Keem, appreciate the 19 or not the 1999. The 99 cent, bro. That was a bag of chips back in the day. But thank you, Zach. Appreciate you, man. I will keep it up uh, again. All right. Hey, I want to announce my new one of my new favorite cards. It doesn't surpass raw. I don't think it surpasses Horus the Black Flame. Hiccup, dragon. But Suma Kutsunagi, the Lord of the Swords. My third favorite card of all time already. He moved up quick. This card is crazy. Um, he just resets the game. We don't need to do it right now, uh, but he, he's, he's pretty insane. He's pretty insane. All right. We are going to start by playing Nikitama which allows us to normal summon another spirit monster. So we could go directly into Suhuma, but instead we're going to go to Aratma, activate Aratma, which searches out a spirit monster unless he negates it, which I am not too mad at. Whatever. It's like, whatever, dude. I'm pretty sure he's going to have bestial cards considering he has this uh, branded regained. So I'm a little bit weary of that. Um, because if I go into all mirage on one of these, I'm pretty sure he'll bestial. But if I'm quick enough, let's see what he does. This could be a mistake. I want to emphasize that this could be a mistake or because I think he's playing bestials. We could just go Dr. Seuss again. Let's just go Dr. Seuss. Then we don't have to send anything to the graveyard right away. And uh, we can start clearing up that board. Don't let his branded regain get going. Topia Prime. Gonna go ahead and punch a Rooney. Hit that main phase two. Go into Dr. Seuss. Seuss! Onto the field. Defense mode. And uh, we're gonna set this here. And we're gonna end right there. We're gonna end right there. We're gonna play a bit of a patient game here. Uh, wait, if he's playing Bistul, no, because that's a fire. I think, yeah, if he's playing Bistuls, he just, he just has nothing he can banish right now. He needs me to put a light mo- Well. Well. Might as well get rid of whatever this is. Ooh, he's playing Thunder Dragons? You little whore. You little whore. Now let's see if he was playing Bistules. He sure was. Of course he was. But that's okay. That's okay. Probably going to hit Dr. Seuss. Oh, no. He's hitting my Aratma, you whore. All right. Depending on what else he had. All right. I'm fine. Yep. We win this game. We win this game. Low diff. Low diff. Low difficulty. Boom. Ooh, electromagnetic toidle. All right. So all we need to do is Yamato no Kami. Banish. Play Yamato no Kami. You can be special summoned if I banish a spirit monster. Uh, and then we're actually just going to go ahead and play electromagnetic turtle to get it into the graveyard if you guys didn't notice light and dark are on the field <laughs> and it equals level 10 <laughs> bring them out bring them out chaos angel <laughs> unaffected by monster effects by the way uh and can't be destroyed by battle gg i don't see how you beat this i don't see how you beat this one partner unless you draw another Raigeki. <laughs> Unless you somehow grab another Raigeki. Then I could be in trouble, but I'm under the impression you're going to Sharen. <laughs> quick, 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 quick. 
beautiful 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 is a mob is a mafia hopefully i'm saying your name right appreciate the five dollars uh you're my first ever streamer donation i'm excited for your 10 million special <laughs> i think you meant one mil but i appreciate you wish you all a hell of a year hey appreciate you man and i i'm honored to be your first streamer dono thank you bro uh fire flight appreciate the ten dollar thank you so much bower appreciate you appreciate you man and uh is that a new mic? It is a new mic. How does it sound, everybody? Hopefully it sounds good. Crazy Nightmare. Appreciate the uh, 999. And your name is Nightmare with a K-Nightmare, bro. Does that mean it's like Yu-Gi-Oh! K-Nightmare, bro? Yu-Gi-Oh! K-Nightmare. First time seeing you live. Hey, bro. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Still sounds stupid? Damn. Sounds pretty good. Thank you, man. What happened to the old one? Nothing. It's just old. Like, I had it for like three four years and i was like man it's time to upgrade so i still have it i just uh it's time to move on also my first live stream hey welcome in joe mojo joe no mojo jojo what does the suma card do uh so when he's normal summoned or flip summoned basically <laughs> it's gonna sound complicated but i'll try to explain it the best i can my opponent can send cards however many cards on his field that he would like or she uh and they can draw that many cards but at the end phase uh the card returns to my hand my card because it's a spirit monster and every other card in the graveyard banish zone field every single card is returned to the deck at the end phase crazy card again sounds complicated but it's kind of crazy. It's kind of nutty. Sam be acting like he's better at deck building. He, he, I mean, he's really not. Sam's a good duelist. Don't get me wrong. But like, come on, man. Come on, man. It, it's levels to this. It's just levels to this. Elijah Williams, appreciate the $10. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys all. All the super chats kind of going crazy on YouTube. Thank you guys. I appreciate you guys. But do you want to know what's free? What doesn't cost a dollar? What doesn't cost a dime? Is spending your time and getting these numbers over there. Here, let me get a little closer. Not my life points. Not my life points. <laughs> this number, my goal is to get to a million by the end of the month. So help me. Thanks. All right. Boom. Draw. So y'all know where this is going negate negate well this isn't a negate but you know we're just gonna turn off these cards we're just gonna turn them off a mono iwato you're, you're done you're done done though done though <laughs> isn't that what they say uh let me go ahead and harpy's feather duster that get that out of here please thank you now i would like to freely use my pot of desires now the reason i use pot of desires Ooh. Well, this isn't good. This actually isn't good. <laughs> this isn't great. This isn't a great situation. I wish I could pretend it was, but it's not. Bro, bro, fight the this is not. Actually, I should have crashed with Amano Iwato. No. All right. Amano Iwato is going to return to the hand. I should have played this first. The reason I didn't go... So, Nikitama, when you play it, allows you to normal summon another spirit monster. The reason I didn't do that is because I was worried that his back row was going to be uh, Sword Soul Blackout or whatever the one is that destroys two. So let's just hope. Let's just hope. We're not in a great situation. Please just go into battle. Yes, just go into battle, baby. Just go into battle for me. Drown in it. Drown in it. Drown in it. Drown in it. All right, we do take some damage, but I'd rather take 1,200 than 5,700. I would rather take 1,200 than 5,700. Ooh, and end phase. Evaporate, appreciate the 100 bits. Love you, Sirius. Hopefully you and Sam continue the wheel series. We will, we will for sure. Don't even worry about that. All right, now we just got to go into our bag. Activate Sakitama. Ooh, he has a maximum C. I should have played a Mono Iwato first, but oh well. Oh well. All right, we're going to play uh, Nikitama. 
Bro, bro, fight the power. All right, we're going to play Sakitama. Now, the reason we're doing this is because now we are going to go ahead and go all Mirage here. Boom. Because when Nikitama is sent to the graveyard, as long as I have a spirit monster, I can draw a card unless he has Ash Blossom. Which I'm under the impression he does or called by. Ash Blossom. Great. You normal summon? He doesn't draw that much. Yeah, I, but I am planning on... So I normal summon sometimes. I do normal summon a bit, but I do want some extra deck plays. But it's crazy that even in a normal summon deck, like this guy is going to draw like two, three cards. That just shows how crazy Ash Blossom is. And this card has to be special summoned. Um, Which we're going to do. So we have to do two more special summons. Regretfully. Boom. What does he have? Does he have called by? He has something he can activate. Bro, bro, fight the power. All right. And the reason we're not playing a Mono Iwato yet is because, again, it turns off my monster effects too that aren't spirit monsters. So that's why I, and I want to use Chaos Angel's effect. So we're going to activate Chaos Angel. Hit this back row. Just a little imperm. Just a little imperm. Uh, we still got rid of this, so whatever. Okay. And now we will play a Mono Iwato. And let's just get some damage in. Unfortunately, we don't win here. But uh, Chaos Angel is pretty tough to overcome. So hopefully... Hopefully it can hold the line. Returns to the hand. Davion Mickens, appreciate the $5. Been here for four years. You still make me laugh. I appreciate it. All right, special summon. You know what I'm going to do? I might do this frame one. I might. Nah, let's, let's take our time. Because I don't want to walk into a triple tactics, whatever, and have him yoink my chaos angel. So if I activate a card effect, it'll be during battle phase, if I must. Unless he plays like a Raigeki. Because again, right now, Chaos Angel, the only thing that beats Chaos Angel is a Spell or Trap. Spell or Trap. Now, I do think he can get the Oonga Boonga Sword Soul guy out here. Um, which could be problematic. Uh, just from sheer battle damage. But again, we are... We are not going to activate a monster effect unless we absolutely have to because too many times have I been hit by triple tactics talent and had this card yoinked from me okay little special summon the one million subscriber will get a kiss from Dion yeah I don't know about that I don't know about that partner uh Lil Nuke appreciate the 12 months happy one year partner on Twitch and a kaiju, yeah, a kaiju would, but if he had a kaiju, he would already played it. Uh, send one worm monster from your deck to the graveyard. Then if you control a non-face, a non-effect monster from, uh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever, dude. In other words, I, I stopped reading. It's crazy how they made, they made worms just because dragons, like dragons had too much support already. So they're like, let's just make dragons, but like they're not called dragons. Dragging these nuts in your mouth. <laughs> All right. Long Yuan. Hello, Long Yuan. Nice to see you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, all right. So he's probably going to bring out the big, scary sword soul guy who lowers my attack points or something. One who's going to have like crazy attack. Yep, this guy, Chen Ying. Okay. And 1,200 damage. That's that's some good damage. All right. That's fine. Vishuda. I say that's fine, but I'm in very serious trouble. When it comes to battle damage. Depending on what he brings out with this level 8 over here. 
Okay. Ooh, this is bad. 25. Ooh. Ooh. This is, this is getting a little scary. This is getting a little scary. Okay. What's he making? Okay. All right. Oh, man. He's just stacking up the banishes to make this thing even stronger. But do we survive? I'm still not activating all Mirage until battle phase because I do not want to hit, get hit by triple tactics. Gosh, I should have just... Sometimes, against Sword Soul, I need to just play Chaos Angel in defense mode. Well, no. I wanted to attack. I wanted to attack. But if it was main phase 2, defense mode. Protect it from Lightning Storm and stuff like that. Jeez, man! Stop! Stop! You're doing too much! Just attack! <laughs> Just attack! Please! Please just attack! Oh my gosh! Oh, I'll run out of time then! It's over. He didn't. I don't think he did have game. It would have been 900. Yeah, he didn't. He didn't have game. Now he's going to have game, but he didn't have game because Al Mirage would have disappeared. Al Mirage does not get attacked in this situation. You're such a whore. I hate you. No one loves you. Damn. Oh, this is a no. See, it would have just been these two, but now, now we lose. Ugh. We would have survived! Now, wait a minute. <laughs> oh, I still get, I still lose. Damn it! If I had one more turn. Oh, Ooh, if I had one more turn. God, that big bitch. That big Cheng Ying bitch, bro. I hate that guy. Tribute it. It doesn't matter. We lose regardless. I left for a minute and I see you lose. Hey, bro. Shouldn't have left. This is your fault. Bro, we were fine. We were fine, but of course he also had Moye, bro. You know what? I'm going to say it. I'm going to say it. I'm, go I'm, I'm just going to say it. I'm just going to say it. Long Yuan deserved uh, to be limited at two and shouldn't be unlimited. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. I said it. All right. What are we playing? What are we playing? He doesn't care about the extra deck. It might be uh, Labyrinth. Ooh, Fenrir. Fenrir. Uh, do I want to hit Fenrir? What's he going to search? Another Fenrir? Do I care about this? What's my hand? I'm going to save Imperm. Go off. Go off. And hey, that was our first loss of the stream. And the last one. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Fenrir search for Fenrir. Shocker. He's going to frame one Maxi now. Maybe. No. Okay. Um. All right. Nikitama allows us to normal summon again. What is your back row? I hope it's Imperm. I hope it's Imperm. I don't want to go about this. You know, speaking of imperm, why did I not imperm this thing first? What am I doing? 
That was foolish of me. I must admit it. I must admit it. Hmm. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Do I want to hit? It's probably Imperm. You know what I could do? I'm not going to activate this because I don't want... I don't want him to banish my stuff. So instead, we're just going to go for the tried and true classic Dr. Seuss. We are going to go for the old tried and true classic Dr. Seuss. Oh, Maxi. Is that what he had the whole time? All right. Well, he's going to draw two cards regretfully. Unless I just take Zeus with... Nah, we'll take Zeus. Nah. Yeah, we'll give him two. We'll give him two, I guess. I suppose. All right, boom. I'm pretty sure that that's Imperm face down. So you know what? This might seem like a waste, but let's just, cause I don't want him to Imperm Zeus later. Yeah, it's Imperm. It's Imperm. I bloody knew it, didn't I? And Labyrinth, you little whore. Hmm. Well, Zeus is Labyrinth's worst nightmare, so whatever. Pink. Get rid of that. And now he can't bring out the other Fenrir because he controls a card. Doctor! <gasps> Zeus! Now this should... Should. Shit on Labyrinth. Should. I'm a little worried that he has a, an Ashy Blossom. So I don't know if I necessarily need to go Pot of Desires right now. I think I'm going to wait. Just a pinch. Just a bit. We're just going to end right there. Now against Labyrinth, he's, he's got to just set a bunch of cards. And I'll just wait for end phase. I will simply just wait for end phase. Oh, I'm hitting that. <laughs> nah, you good. Nah, you good. Nah, you good, OG. Bum, bum, bum. That's fine. You can set whatever you want, partner. You can set whatever you want. And we got evenly in the hand. I, I feel pretty good. I feel pretty good. I feel pretty good. Now, it hasn't happened yet, but remember when I told you guys that that Suma card that I had? Um, like, takes all the banished cards, all the cards in the graveyard, all the cards on the field, returns it to the deck. That's why I'm playing Pot of Desires. Uh, because no matter what gets banished, as long as I have that card, then I'm fine. What is, what, what, okay. Nice. You really showed me. Wow. Nightmare Phoenix. Oh, no, not that. Bro thought I was going to activate Zeus on Nightmare Phoenix when I have no back row. Oh, no. What is bro doing? What is bro doing? Go ahead, special summon it. Oh, uh, you're going to unicorn me. Oh, you should have unicorned me. What is bro up to? You should have unicorned me. Unicorn would force me to use Zeus. Now I'm actually worried about about unicorn just a little bit. And because of that, I uh, I don't even know if he's playing. Oh, you know what? He might have lost it off of his extrav. He might have lost his unicorn off of extravagance. That's got to be it. Why wouldn't he use unicorn? We have two pops, so I might use one now. But he's trying to bait it. There was no point in doing what he did. Ugh. I don't think... I think he got rid of his unicorn with Extrav. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna let it go. I might regret it. 
If he goes unicorn right now, then oh, he doesn't have it. You don't have it. You don't have what it takes. You don't have what it takes, partner. Oh, wow. You really showed me, dude. All right. End phase. Yep. I will activate it. We'll send, uh, send these guys away. Goodbye. Goodbye. Deru. All right. Now let's play Pot of Desires. The only way Pot of Desires backfires on us is if we hit our... We didn't hit any of them, so that's good. We got it. Oh, so beautiful, man. So beautiful. Nikitama. All right. Now, this is probably a mistake, but I just want y'all to see what it does. I just want y'all to see what it does. First of all, he's got a dope animation. Again, if you just walked in, my new favorite card. Sumahua! Kusanagi! Lord of the Swords. All right. So, Nikitama allows me to draw a card since I control a spirit monster. And uh, this guy just resets the entire game. All right. He's going to reset the entire game uh, during the end phase. So, let's get our licks in. That means Zeus is going to go away, by the way. But this is why I don't worry about playing Pot of Desires in this deck. Because, look, I banished 10 cards. And you're going to be like, oh, man, that's so risky. What if you got rid of good cards? Well, partner. Well, partner. End my turn. This is going to come back to the hand. And then everything, look at that. Everything gets returned to the decks. Reset the game. And carry on. We got evenly. We got Dark Ruler no more. He's playing Labyrinth. We got to Imperm in the hand. I'm comfortable. We're good. We're good. We are good. Look at him. This is literally me, the card. Nice, bro. What are you going to do about Imperm? <laughs> yes. Yes. No. No, partner. Now watch as I draw into Harpy's Feather Duster. Imagine. Ooh, that'd make me happy. That would be that would bring joy to my little heart. Uh, would you mind activating effects during my main phase instead of draw phase? That'd be that'd be dope. Okay. Okay. Row, row, fight the All right. Uh, let's just evenly. Let's see what evenly's hitting for. I'm just a little concerned because uh, labyrinth players, they're resourceful. I'll give them that. These, they, these little motherfuckers are resourceful. All right. He's just worried that I'm going to get an exceed monster out, I guess. I'm not. Uh, he's probably going to keep uh, this one on the field. Yep. All right. At a bit of a standstill. Now, this is normally, again, I should not have played this. I just wanted you guys to see what it did because it's so cool to me. I should not. I should have saved it. It's a card that you're supposed to save for a dicey situation. Having Zeus on the field is much better uh, in this situation. That's a good draw. That's a good little card to draw right there. What do you got face down, you little bitch? Oh, wait. Can't be destroyed. Let's Dark Ruler no more first because it can't be destroyed. While he has a set card. So we have to do it in this order. Now let's just ride Geki it. Uh, we're not in a great spot though, man. He's never going to activate cards during my main phase. Oh. <gasps> Wait a minute. Oh, uh, but what if he hits? Oh, man. If you hit my fucking... If you hit my triple tactics talent, you little bitch. If you hit my triple tactics talent... Oh, he didn't even summon that. Okay. Uh, no, then it just comes right back. Shit. Wait, no, that's fine. That's fine. Because then he's going to activate it. And then we win. Activate it. Activate it. Activate the one in your hand. Wait, no, because it's in defense mode. Ah, oh, we just got to go draw two. We just got to go draw two. Oh, I can't do damage this turn anyway because of Dark Ruler no more. 
I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Hopefully that one card in his hand is not Ash Blossom. That will annoy me. That will annoy me. Thank God. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> you are a fool. Did you really think you could defeat me? <laughs> Come forth once again. Sumahua Kusanagi. The Lord of the Swords. Activate. Activate. And what's cool about this is chain blocked, by the way. So even if he had something, uh, he would have to negate that instead of instead of this. I wish I didn't draw another one of these, but it is what it is. So again, he has the choice. He can either send cards away and we can both draw for the amount of cards he sends away. Or he can say, I don't want to send any cards away. And then end phase. All right. Uh, what do I want to grab here? I'm honestly, I think it's best to grab Imperm for next turn just to be safe. But I could pot of desires and just get everything right back. You know what I mean? Just a quick little draw too, just because. Imperm definitely safer though. I'm grabbing pot of desires. I'm grabbing pot of desires. I like to live life on the edge because again, all 10 of these cards that get banished we're gonna get right back. So this just became. But he got one card in the hand. How, what does Labyrinth do with two cards in the hand? Like, let's talk about it. Like, there's nothing you can do. Come on now. You, you got nothing. Set two and pass. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's no, no, bro. Will you just go away? Will you just go away, man? I'm done scrapping with you. I'm done scrapping with you. I, I, I've had my fill. I've had my fill of scrapping with you. Oh, and he brings out this hoe, man. Oh, man. Ugh. Add one labyrinth card. Yeah, he's going to add the big. No, nah, the st stove Torby. Stove Kirby. All right. Pot of Desires, I need you to grab me two good ones. Two good ones, baby. I need two good ones. I need two good ones. That'll work. That'll work for me. That'll that'll work for me. Aratma. Activate. Aratma. Grab. Sakitama. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Activate Sakitama. Normal summon. Sakitama. Tribute. For all Mirage over Aratma. Al Mirage. Banish from the grave. Aratma. For Yamato no Kami. Yes. Light and darkness merge to form. Chaos Angel! Chaos Angel! Activate. Banish. Yeah! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah! Scram! Chaos Angel. What deck is he playing? I love when people ask that because like, you cannot simply define my decks with a mere word anyway, spirit. <laughs> because my deck is not Ray, but you still got questions, don't you? You don't know what the fuck that means. Now, if I said Castira, oh yeah, I know what Castira is. If I said Tier Laments, you'd be like, oh, I know what Tier Laments is, but I'm a little bit different over here, all right? I'm not your standard guy, huh? You think you're gonna collab with Dotto soon? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I guess we'll have to see. <laughs> Freddy Fazbear on that slap. <laughs> How are there 3.3 thousand people in here, but only 1.1K likes? I don't know. That's a good question. Oh, brother. 
This guy's playing Math Max Circular. You little whore. All right, Math Max could be a problem. It's the Syriax deck. Exactly. Thank you. See, YouTube knows. Damn, I missed a $50 dono. Hope you're still here. Uh, Psyche, Psyche, Psyche Killer. Appreciate the 50. I need to get YouTube alerts set up because I don't have any YouTube alerts. So I apologize if I miss uh, Super Chats. Uh, I, I get to them eventually, but sorry if I take a while to get to them. A Reacts, really love your content. Should check out uh, Card Fight Vanguard. You might like it. A new game mode uh, for the series is coming out soon. Uh, so it's a good time to get into it. If you like the game, you can use this 50 uh, for when the booster box comes out. What's it called? Card Fight Vanguard. I never heard of that. Card Fight Vanguard. The hell is that? All right. The first thing I saw was a. Uh... <laughs> what is this? Some... Who the hell? Bro, <laughs> why is this the first card I saw? I'm not going to put it on the screen because, man, I don't know. If the... I don't even know if that's TOS or not. <laughs> but the guy whose name is Father of All Mankind, Adam. That was the first card to pop up when I wrote Card Fight Vanguard. If you guys want to look it up, look it up yourself. Father of all mankind, Adam. Uh, from the card game Card Fight Vanguard. I am... Uh, all right. <laughs> why Why is that the first card that popped up? Not, not, not a great first impression. I cannot lie to you. I cannot tell a lie. What is going on? I need your deck building brain for real. What up, Vanta? Hope you're doing good, brother. Bro, my my brain, the way it works, see, and that's the thing too. Like, sometimes people will see the well-oiled machine, but they see the deck where it's at and not where it's been, bars. Damn. Let me say that again. You guys see my deck where it's at, but not where it's been. You didn't see my deck in the struggle. You didn't see my deck when I was doing all these different test duels against and it's always in ranked because i'm stupid i would always go into ranked with these decks and like you know try you know fail 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 adjust the ratio adjust the ratio adjust the ratio take a bunch of stuff out add a bunch of stuff in you know over and over and over again until finally until finally it starts winning that's me but i love that like, i love doing that when it comes to deck building it's almost like like for example, some people, when they play 2K, when they make their my player, they just put them on like a good ass team. And they're like, yeah, I'm trying to win. You know, let's go. I'm trying to get drafted by this team in 2K, my my player, whatever. Me, I'm going to the worst team in the NBA. I'm going to at least bottom five teams in the NBA. And I'm trying to bring that. I'm trying to turn that franchise around, baby. I'm trying to turn the spirit franchise around, baby. And make a name for them. Yeah. Bring him up from the trenches. Yeah. Hey, appreciate the $100. Uh, $100, my fault. 100 bits. Don't think we forgot about you not making that space, Mambo. Deck op optimal. Hey, man, one day. One day. See, the issue is, too, it has to be a deck that I have fun with. I love space, Mambo. In GOAT format. Like, it's funny. But, come on, man. Like, they gotta, they gotta have some... See, Space Mambo was fine, but the cousins of Space Mambo that I was trying to bring along, bro, they wasn't doing it for me. Jose Lopez, appreciate the $5. Can we donate directly to the 2K hard drive recovery fund? The what? 2K hard drive recovery fund? What are you talking about? Are you talking about the two terabyte hard drive that I had? Or are you talking about me working at 2K? I don't got no fucking hard drive from when I worked at 2K. That would be illegal. If you're talking about for the Soul Link, I already recovered that and I paid $600 for that. So the Soul Link is not canceled. I paid over half a thousand dollars to prevent the Soul Link from being canceled. YouTube, you might not know this story. I think I told it to Twitch, but let me tell you the story, YouTube. Uh, so not too long ago, my hard drive or my SSD that you know was where i booted my pc from basically got corrupted stopped working and i couldn't turn on my pc so i had to replace it uh obviously i had some data on that hard drive but i didn't think it was anything important i was like ah, maybe there's some footage here or there that i could just re-record whatever boom okay 
couple months later, uh, we finally get the next episode of Soul Link sent in from uh, the editor, Yako. And I'm like, oh, bet we can post Soul Link. I can post this. Post it. Boom. And now we're like, oh, finally, because we had that recorded for months. Okay. That's what you guys don't understand. Usually, not right now, but usually we have Soul Link recorded for a very long time before it turns into a video. Okay. That's, well, historically, that's how it's been so far. Okay. So once. We finally get that video, the most recent one that I uploaded. I'm like, oh, bet. Now we can finally record more Soul Link. Let's do it. And then I was like, something's missing here. I can't see it. And uh, it turns out my drive had uh, the old Soul Link on there. The Soul Link save data was lost on that drive. Or not lost, but it was on that drive. Okay, so that was bad. That was very bad. Uh, hold on. Let me let me try to navigate around this board. Long story short, sent in the SSD to a data recovery center, and they were like, "Oh, it's gonna cost like two thousand dollars, or like yeah, like a thousand, two thousand dollars for you to uh, have this all recovered because they charge based off of how much space the hard drive has, and it was a two terabyte hard drive or SSD." And uh, I was like, dang, that's crazy because all I need is like 100 megabytes off of it because it's just the save data. Uh, and then we negotiate back and forth. I let them know the situation. I'm like, do you know that I'm doing a series on YouTube and I need this, please? And, uh, you know, begged a little bit, prodded a little bit and negotiate them down to $600, <laughs> uh, which is still a lot. But I was like, hey, 600 versus 2000. Fuck it. So got it all recovered. And uh, Soul Link has been saved. We just have to record it. All right. Now beating this board. I'm pretty sure he has a negate. Um, I think what I'm going to do is activate Sakitama. It need negates. It need negates. We're gonna play Nikitama. It need negates. It need negates. It need negates. Hmm, you're going frame one into that. Ballsy. Ballsy. Now, the reason we didn't go straight into evenly matched is because I'm pretty sure this face down card is a negate. Although I'm not 100% sure. All right. Uh, he's going to remove a card from my hand and he's going to remove Nikitama from the field. Whatever, whatever. And then I think this is a negate as well. Or the card that's attached to it's a negate. It's a Ratma. I didn't want him to hit a Ratma, but whatever. Okay. Uh, but we still have two normal summons. So we play Sakitama. And then we tribute it for... Sumahua. Kutsunagi, Lord of the Sword. Activate. Activate. Chain blocked, by the way. So I'm actually chilling. What the hell? <laughs> what the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Uh, we're gonna go ahead and grab Nikki Tama actually. Chain blocked. So you have to just negate the graveyard card. That's all you can negate. <laughs> Unless that's imperm, then fuck you. But I don't think it's imperm. I don't think it is. I don't think it is. Now let's see what he does. Let's see what he does here. Yep. So he has to negate the Sakitama because the chain block. All right. Now this is a huge decision he has here. He has to decide which cards he's going to send to the graveyard. And then we both get to draw cards for that amount of cards. If he doesn't send any, then all I have to do is end my turn. All I have to do is end my turn and watch the fireworks. He sends one. <laughs> one was enough. Hold on. Can this be destroyed? Let's see. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Negate any... <laughs> there's no point, though. There's no point because these are all going to go away. So there's no point in me hitting Raigeki right now. Sure, I could get some damage, but it's not going to win me the game. Instead, I will simply end my turn. Watch. Let's watch the fireworks together. Chat. Let's watch the fireworks together. And by watch the fireworks together, I'm probably still gonna lose because he's gonna have five cards in his hand. He can go access code and do his whole combo all over again. And uh, <laughs> look at all that. <laughs> it's funny, but yeah. What we need in this deck, and I, and I gotta add it back. I just took it out so I could run time tearing Morganite, but Battle Fader, really good in this deck. 
but obviously it's a hand trap so if i play time tearing morganite can't use hand traps so i'm probably gonna go back to adding battle fader all right let's just hope he runs out of time have you checked out the new wing dragon of raw support in duel links it's pretty fun to play um so to answer your question no on duel links i have not but i will say that any support that duel links got master duel probably got it like a while ago so i have probably played it like i think you guys just got a immortal phoenix which is cool but what i would be curious about is like if merit got new skills for wing dragon of raw i think that's more interesting than um than the cards themselves because master duel has had them for a while you think you're the king i'm the king brother in christ you have you have like one of the 2009 emoji faces in your name what are you the king of hmm in case Twitch doesn't know, it's the upward arrow. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll write it for you. Just in case you guys don't know what face I'm talking about. Here, I got you. I got you. Hold on. Hold on. Let's add text. Uh-huh. Boom. He has... Uh, there's nothing wrong with this face, but like you can't come into my chat saying I'm the king and you got this... <laughs> you got this face in your name. <laughs> Bro came into my YouTube chat saying, you're not the king. I'm the king. <laughs> Bro, if you don't get your fucking happy Pikachu looking ass. I'm the king. Everyone in chat, hit that face. Everyone in chat, hit this face real quick. I want to see. I want to in both chats, hit this face. Anyway, we lose, by the way. Because he's going to be 10,100 attack or whatever. 10,100 attack. Never mind, just 11,000. Ah! Kawaii! Face ass. <laughs> oh my god. I'm the king! <laughs> Bro, if you don't get your ass out of here. <laughs> oh my goodness all right let's get to diamond real quick man I, I i'm tired of not being in diamond like what are we talking about right now can't believe i'm not in diamond right now dude all right get rid of that we are gonna get rid of oh you know what battle fader wouldn't have saved us in that situation either uh then we also have to get rid of this all right let's just go double battle fader battle fader <laughs> the kawaii king <laughs> oh i am deborah king of the demon realm <laughs> oh it's like oh and that literally happened to deborah hold on deborah uh other world Oh shit. <laughs> bro, bro, fight the Bawa. Oh my gosh. <laughs> chat. Hey chat. Hey chat. Chat. This 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 is the king he thinks he is. This is the king he thinks he is, all right? But this is the king he actually is. <laughs> uh, how how you see yourself versus how everyone else sees yourself. Hey, hey nothing, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. But you can't come through you're saying, I am the king. But you hit me with, with that. Come on, man. Come on, man. <laughs> I am the king. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, let me stop. Let me stop. Oh, it's
Lawrence, Castira, our good friends over at Castira Enterprise is here. And I have a card for you. It's called Triple Tactics Thrust. What did you banish, you whore? One of my evenly matched whore. Your hand clears hard. It, it, it really does. It really does. Castira is like, look, and knock on wood. Hey, maybe, maybe this is going to be a funny clip because you could like take what I'm about to say and put it up to what happens. But I'm going to say it. Castira free. Castira free. Now, I don't know what's about to happen. He might have Ash Blossom. He might have Ash Blossom plus Droll. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. And, and not that that. No, he can't. Well, no, those have to be discarded, not sent to the graveyard like Maxi. Yeah, but yeah, then free, 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 free. I'm speaking free into existence because even if he does activate something, boom, triple tactics, thrust or talent, we're going to go thrust. Then we're going to go talent. Going to yoink this little doofus. And uh, I think we big chilling, but um, we'll see. We shall see. Bro, stop banishing my cards. How about that? TRX, what was your favorite deck from the Wheel of Yu-Gi-Oh? It, it would have been one of the older decks, not one of the modern ones. I don't hate the modern ones, but like my favorite ones were definitely probably some of the some of the F tier type stuff. I don't know which one in particular, but those ones are fun because I feel like it's more creative. It's not just like, oh, this card in this archetype, me throw in. You know, it's more like, hmm, I wonder how to like make this shitty thing work. Activated Fenrir when you had the chance, Boosie. Now I'm going to crush you and throw your field into the wind. <laughs> this is the type of duel you love to see. <laughs> Oh my goodness. All right, hold on. If he's dumb, he'll be like, oh, I'll just keep my whole field. That's what they do sometimes. He's like, I like my field. I'll keep my field. But he doesn't realize end phase. He loses it all anyway. Please. That would be perfect for me if he doesn't get rid of anything. If he doesn't get rid of anything, that would be perfect for me. Please, please, please don't get rid of anything. Or if you do, just get rid of anti-spell fragrance. Let's see. Let's see what he does. Come on, don't get rid of anything. Don't get rid of anything. He's reading my card right now because it's very complicated to read. He's like, wait, what? What? I have to do what? He doesn't. He, it's so it's so like convoluted, bro. Again, he can send as many cards as he wants to the graveyard and draw that many cards. End phase, he loses everything and it gets shuffled into the deck regardless. It's over. It's over. He, he didn't do it. He didn't do it. He's like, oh, wait, what, why would I do that? And the beauty against Castira is this. Any card he banishes from my extra deck is coming back. It does not matter. My deck shits on your, like, hey, kudos to you for getting anti-spell fragrance. Uh, let's just hope you get it again because you're going to need it. 
Watch. It doesn't matter. What are you going to hit? Zeus? Don't care. What are you going to hit? Underworld guy? It doesn't matter. Zeus? Oh, no. Ah. Ah. Zeus is gone. Ah. 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 Anyway, now build this entire board all over again, except with only three cards in your hand next turn. Go ahead. Lock my whole board. It doesn't matter. It does, it, it, he really thinks he's gaming right now. He really thinks he's gaming right now, and that's what's finding me. That's what's finding me. That's what's finding me. Bro's about to look up at his board. This is going to be bro in a second. This is going to be bro in a second. <coughs> Watch this. Watch this. All I got to do is end my turn. Watch the fireworks, chat. Watch the fireworks. Go! <laughs> Build your board again. Draw anti-spell fragrance again. I implore you. I implore you, draw it again. Draw it again. All that reading for what? For what? To still make a fool of yourself. <laughs> quick, 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 quick. If he draws it again, yeah, I'll throw up. Yeah, I will. <laughs> you caught me. I'll throw up. <laughs> Bro got cast your birth? Is this limited yet? When does this get limited? I'm gonna need them to hurry up and limit this. All right, he's probably gonna punch punch. He's probably gonna punch punch. All right, he's getting the board set up again though. But Cashier can't really OTK, so I'm not too worried. The only thing I'm concerned about is what I draw next turn. Is what I draw next turn. Got! Defense position, oh, thank God. He actually, that got scary. I'm not gonna lie, that got scared. I lost. Fuck! No! Ah, at oh no, I'm gonna sneeze. At and this game sucks. And this game sucks, bro. Oh, Castier are free though. <laughs> Castier is still free. Oh, I forgot about that stupid ass attacks and defense mode card. <laughs> Show the reaction picture. Nani, it's me now. Now it's me. Ah, 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 that's me. Me when my opponent has everything after I got rid of everything. <laughs> Nani. Raina. Berthold. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, guys, I, I can't help that I sneezed, man. Uh, add one branded spell or trap. No, no, I refuse to allow you to do that. The answer is no, no. <laughs> you lame as hell for that, bro. Why? Why, man? <laughs> I thought it was a pretty sick joke. <laughs> Thought I made a pretty sick joke right there. <laughs> I hit him with the hui hui hui. What's he gonna do? <laughs> What's he gonna do? Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Aratma. Go ahead. That means he has a bistral in his hand, by the way. Mm, you sick son of a bitch. You dare make me look like a fool in front of everyone. I promise to make you regret this, you little whore, because I'm going to leave you with nothing. You've pissed me off for the last time. I'm going to Pot of Desires comfortably because I can get them all back. Perhaps you should have ashed this one, you ashy whore. Or perhaps this one, <laughs> you ashy whore. <laughs> you asked the wrong card, didn't you? <laughs> Yugi boy. <laughs> oh, Yugi boy. Oh. <laughs> 
Oh, brother, I forgot. He gets that off of my card, too. Go ahead, return my card. You think I give a fuck? All right, so you get one extra card. Big whoop, Walla the bother. Boom, boom. Get rid of that card of forever. Chaos Angel. Activate the Chaos Angel. Get rid of this mother card all on you. Activate Triple Tactics Thrust. Set Imperm. Quick, 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 quick. I'm going to punch you really hard now. Oh, it's main phase two. Fuck. <laughs> nah, nah. I forgot about my evenly matched play. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> Sayonara. Quick, 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 quick. Quick, 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 quick. I just want to get to the 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 disassignment again. What's that 11 star monster? Oh, it's just me as a Yu-Gi-Oh card. That's all. <laughs> when you see that card, just know it's me. <laughs> it's me. It's literally me. Please be a Labyrinth player. Oh my God, this card makes Labyrinth players cry. Please be a Labyrinth player. Just set a bunch of cards. Just set a bunch of cards. Oh my God. Oh my God, I hate. Math Mech, I might hate more than any other card. Or not any other card, let me stop. Math Mech, Runic are my top two. And again, not because they're super crazy good. I just despise playing against Math Mech. I despise playing against Runic more so than I think anything. Maybe Dragon Link, just because of how long they take. I get it. I, I think Dragon Links are cool. Don't get me wrong. Cool cards. But goddamn, do they take forever. And and then any form of Pendulum, you know? Sorry. Pendulums, you don't... You, you're not safe here. You're not safe here. <laughs> but Math Mech and Runic, ooh. My, my lordy. My lordy, do I be wanting to vomit out of my mouth and fucking... I didn't have any follow-up. No follow-up. Does your children hear you quick, quick, quick? And so what if they do? Hey, Omron, appreciate the $10. Uh, you have to play this against Sam. Uh, you just know he's gonna misplay and start staring at the roof. Also, isn't it about time you make a new meta cubic deck? Kind of miss seeing Nova. Dreams of Nova. Um, I still have a cubic deck. The issue is Castier kind of like shot on cubics for a while. Uh, just because, now, don't get me wrong. If you have the perfect hand against Castira, Cubics are great. But then, then again, that's like any deck. You have the perfect hand, you know? Uh, where Cubics struggled is when Arise Heart came out, Cubics depend on getting a bunch of cards in their graveyard. Uh, Arise Heart obviously prevents that. So, it was very, it was, it was very tough for Cubics. It's just a losing matchup, usually, if they get Arise Heart out. Uh, but if you already have Crimson Nova in your hand and like some of the right stuff, then, you know, it's beatable, but yeah, right when that card came out, it was a heavy nerf to Cubics inadvertently. Syriax wins the next dual wheel video. I don't know, bro. I'm not asking you. Stop. Stop. Stop speaking to me. Do not speak to me. Bro, it's annoying because I'll say my username because I'm reading you guys' chat, which is Syriax. But this bitch thinks I'm saying Siri asks. Hey, Siri. Uh -huh. I'm not talking to you. You are not Syriax. You are not him. I didn't get that. Could you try again? Sure, bitch. What I said is you're not him. She hung up on me. Quick, 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 Y'all see the new Monster Reborn card? I did see it. Mr. Midas805, appreciate the five gifted subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
I appreciate it. Bro, bro, fight the power. Trying to think, do I have any plays? I could Denko Seca, but it's kind of risky. I'd rather evenly first. Denko Seca actually just bro, shuts bro, down the back the row power. here. But then I would be banking on Pot of Desires just kind of saving me. So instead, I'm going to go into Batal. And I'm sure he has a negate. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn Toggle on. I'm going to go into main phase DOS. I'm going to activate. <laughs> As I thought, Tor, you better. You better. You don't have a choice, do you? <laughs> 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 Ooh. Ooh. All right, he's gonna get rid of a card from my hand. Oh no, oh no, let's see what he hits. What's he gonna hit? Random card in my hand. Denko Seca, oh no, ah. No. Evenly matched. I will negate it for my name is Ring War. Wing roar, hear my roar, growl. Face ass, bro, that's him. That's him. Urgh, that'll show you. I was ready for your evenly matched. Look up, nigga. <laughs> what will you do about the second one, Anoki? Quick, 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 quick. Quick, 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 quick. <laughs> oh. What will you do about the second one on... <laughs> I almost said on... Instead of on Noki, I almost said on Nick. <laughs> what will you do about the second one? All right. Um. Does he have an Ashy Blossom? Does he have an Ashy Blossom? He probably does, because Math Mechs just always have exactly what they need, by the way. Uh, he already activated a Maximum C. Um, I'm going to pot our Desires first. See if he has Ashy Blossom. He doesn't. <laughs> oh, why you shouldn't have. <laughs> bro, bro, <fight> the <laughs> you shouldn't have. Mm, you shouldn't have Yugi boy. Mm, Yugi boy. Mm. All right. Still isn't extremely simple. What does he have that he can activate? What does he have that he can activate? Does he? Oh, does he have effect veiler? I think this little asshole has effect veiler. Make sure I'm not missing something. Cause he had something, something was toggled when I summoned this, but I don't know what. Okay. Anything in the graveyard that can activate when I summon a card? You know what? To be safe, I'm afraid of Effect Veiler. Hmm. I wish I could tell a lie, but I am afraid of Effect Veiler. And uh, Effect Veiler will stop this, which would be bad because we would just pretty much lose so i think this is a safer play for me i wanted to play this very badly but i'm pretty sure he has effect failure he's not activating it though mm. now i could grab sakitama or I could go into Chaos Angel, which could save me. We are main phase two, so Chaos Angel might actually be the play. He does have max C, so he would draw two cards. No, he would draw three cards. Unless, yeah, he would draw three cards. Fuck. Go Chaos Angel, I guess. Get some sort of defense set up. God, I hate letting him draw. I hate this. Maxi should be banned or limited to one or something. 
I would just suggest banned personally. That's just me. All right, we're gonna put this in defense mode. Look at that, man. It was like bare minimum special summons. You draw three fucking cards. Kind of insane. Kind of insane. Let's go ahead and hit this. And get rid of it. Be rid of it. Bye. All right. You just end there. Unfortunately. We had much cooler plays, but uh i'm 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 just pretty sure he has a fucking course he has that a fucking course he has that because why wouldn't he it wasn't imperm in his hand earlier because he couldn't have played it with a monster he, so I'm, I'm i think he still has effect bailer as well but that extra deck is getting a little thin so we'll see what he's able to i think he could still go access code damn access code for game two even he could pop this now because he negated it. Actually, before access code shows up. No, I don't want to get triple tactics, so we're going to wait. This is bad. I'm a little nervous. Tyler uh, Bertol Bertolozzi, appreciate the 999. Hey, CRX, first time doing one of these, but love the content, man. Hope you hit your goal. Keep it up. You deserve it. Thank you, man. I appreciate the words. Thank you, thank you, and appreciate the donation. Very generous. I hope you have an amazing day and an amazing life. <sighs> He's definitely going access code, by the way. I'm honestly not as scared of access code as I am him having a triple tactics card in his in his hand. A triple tactics card would be devastating for me. G Golem Crystal Heart, Ganani. Bringing out Transcode Talker. I do think we lose, but and it's it, what's crazy is it's all because of Maxi. Drawing three cards is so fucking crazy. All right, he's accessing the code. Can't respond to access codes effects, so we turn toggle on. We just activate all Mirage immediately. And uh, hope he doesn't have triple tactics talent, because if he does, he'll yoink Chaos Angel and we lose even worse. But I think I think we might lose regardless. And I, I'm going to check, too. I'm going to see if he has a. Uh... Oh, OK, so we survive. We survive. But I'm definitely after this duel going to check if he has um. What's it called? You know what I'm talking about. Uh, effect Veiler, because that's what I was worried about earlier. I want to see if he has Effect Veiler. Yeah. Something he can activate, like a quick effect. 
Oh, nigga, it's this thing. Well, that's bad. I think we just... Oh, my fucking God. Yep, that's game. Oh, my favorite card. All right, let's see if he activates it. I'm sure he will. And then we will at you our way out of this one. <laughs> I was waiting for it to activate. I was waiting for it to activate. All right. Um, yeah, I want to see. Did he have effect Baylor? Because like if he didn't, then I, I psyched myself out. If he didn't have effect Baylor, I psyched myself out. He did. He did. He had that one of effect Baylor in his hand. So I made the right move. Uh, it just unfortunately, I, I, I didn't have the tools. Wait, your bottle is green? Yeah. The green water bottle, partner. Mountain Valley spring water. Mountain Valley spring water. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll go ahead and uh, <laughs> turn off the filter. Wow, it is green. <laughs> hey, chat, I bet I bet y'all won't get my sub count up to 969,200 uh, <laughs> little steps, baby steps. Nine hundred sixty-nine thousand two hundred, or better yet, oh, did I miss the nine six nine six nine? No, I didn't. Chat goals. Chat nine six nine six nine six nine. Memes. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, he's playing penguins. An actual Chad duelist. I thought about doing this for Christmas, but then I didn't. I thought about doing this for Christmas, but then I didn't. First time in a Siri X Twitch stream, but hope everyone in chat's having a great day. Hey man, appreciate you coming through. Is Castier a deck that good? It's depends on what it's dueling against. I mean, it's meta defining, but if you're prepared for it, no, it's, it's, it's good. Don't get me wrong, but it's not like some unbeatable force, you know? If you have the right cards for it, then uh, it's 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 quite beatable. What he need Rise Heart for? What are you talking about? Did he grab Rise Heart with uh, Fenrir? Oh, he did. I don't know. I don't know what he's up to. Guess we're gonna find out. Bro's playing Penguins. A Chad. Dave Brewington, appreciate the $10. Lose, King, you only have wins and draws. You take no L's. <laughs> Love you and your content. Road to a million. You know what? You're right, bro. Anytime I lose, I just wanted my opponent to have a better day. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Ricardo Torres, appreciate the 999 earlier. Sorry if I missed this a while ago. You should give Mario Kart 8 Deluxe a try with Donald and Rhyme and Sam. It doesn't get more toxic. Bro, I played that. I think I played that on the channel before. It's been a while, but yeah, I've played that. Uh, it's been a while. Would love to play it again. It's always fun. It's always toxic. Birth to one was unnecessary for real. Um, birth at three is kind of crazy though. To one, yeah, I'll agree. It's, it might be a little unnecessary. It does hurt the deck a lot. But birth at three made that deck kind of like, not OP, because again, it's beatable. But it was just a little much. I think, it, I think a good semi limit would have been okay for that card. Chaos Ruler getting banned is crazy. All right, what, what, what's he got here? Cicada King. Special summon one insect monster. All right, and then what do you do? Cannot target face down defense. Uh, when your opponent activates a monster effect, quick effect, flip one face down, you control face up. Oh no, not that. I'm about to embarrass you. I'm about to end this man's whole career. <laughs> Oh, it's just going to hurt his feelings so much. He's playing penguins, man. He's playing penguins. He doesn't deserve this. Oh, fucking, I'm going to beat this nigga's ass. <laughs> oh, my gosh. 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nikki Tama. And then a double normal summon so you don't draw anything. <laughs> All right. You can either send your card away and draw one or have it leave during the end phase. Either way, you're fucked. <laughs> Either way, you are, um, you are fucked. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're cooked. You're cooked. You're cooked. Go ahead. Keep it on the field. It doesn't matter. It's leaving regret. Yeah, you might as well draw a card for it. Yep, that's why we have Battle Fader, because spirit cards always return to the hand. So, uh, that's why Battle Fader is important for this deck. Also, it has infinite uses. So Battle Fader's drawbacks is normally after you use its effect, it gets banished. Uh, but Suma Kusanagi, the Lord of the Swords, doesn't give a fuck because he's bringing them all back. So infinite Battle Faders as long as we have it. I will be petty. Don't act like I won't be petty and I won't just Harpy's Feather Duster one card because I will. Oh, you bet your sweet bippy I will. You bet your sweet bippy I'll Harpy's Feather Duster one card. Because why not, Mink? Called by Ah. Ah, not called by Ah. And now I'm just going to beat you down with a Mono Iwato. On repeat. Boom, boom, ba -dum, boom. Dion, you still have that God of War themed deck. Just curious. That was really fun. I don't still have it crafted, but the beauty of having a video on it is I could always recreate it, you know? Uh, and I'd probably modify it because I made that like before. Oh, brother, this guy has cash deer or fan rear. <laughs> like, dude, get a life, dude. <laughs> am I right? Am I right or am I right, dude? <laughs> am I right or am I right, dude? Um, do I let this go through? <sighs> I guess. I don't really care. Like, why would I care, dude? Like, I don't give a fuck, dude. Like, guy like me doesn't give a fuck dude go off get off dude got a war deck war rock uh it did have some war rock shit in there but it also had it wasn't just war rock i also had like some of the 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 trolls dwarfs trolls my bad damn that was that was fucked up the the dwarfs like uh brock and sindri like i had cards that were what's the word signified by them that's the word i'm looking for here all right uh, i'm actually going to end my turn so i think i'm at hand limit so i can discard a card yep we want to discard this so then we can actually summon this guy next turn and again we have battle fader in hand so i'm not too too worried about whatever he does it doesn't really scare me it doesn't really scare me to be honest One cast your monster. Probably gonna bring out Rise Heart. Bam, 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 ba -dum, bam, bam. You in Diamond yet? I am not. I started the stream in Platinum three, maybe Platinum two. Uh, we're in Platinum one right now. You know, Maxi's here and there, kind of, kind of shat on me a little bit. I ain't gonna lie. <sighs> I wanted to go back, but if I go back, I'll experience the toxicity. Hey, man, it's just a little light toxicity, bro. Ain't nothing crazy. Ain't nothing crazy. Do I care about taking this damage? Shit. What doesn't kill me make me stronger type. You know what I mean? What doesn't kill me make me stronger. And plus Fenrir would banish it if I did summon it. So, all right. This is what we're going to do. This is what we're going to do. All right. Activate Sakitama. He's gonna activate Maxi. No, he's not. Amano Iwato. Now he cannot activate Fenrir. Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh bring out Yamato no Kami. Onto the field. And then um I could 
play the whole game reset, but there's no point at this point in time. I'm going to go Sakitama. Uh, unfortunately here. Unfortunately here. Actually, I might go Dr. Seuss instead of Chaos Angel. Because if I go Chaos Angel, I can't activate its effect. Which I guess doesn't really matter. Yeah, let's just, let's just go Chaos Angel. Let's just go Chaos Angel. I don't really need its effect. Chaos Angel. Hope you're enjoying not being able to activate effects, partner. Because I'm enjoying watching you be unable to activate effects. So yeah, you play uh, Amano Iwato. They can't activate Max E. They can't activate Ash Blossom. So you're free to activate whatever you want as long as you get this guy out there. Bum, 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 bum. Same blue. It's been a while, partner. Appreciate the 35 months, man. Look at this handsome ass motherfucker. Hey. <laughs> You gonna make me blush, bitch. What's your favorite non-meta deck? Uh, it varies. My 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 opinion on decks kind of like just depends on your mood. It's just like you're not in the mood for pizza every day. You know what I mean? You love pizza, but you ain't in the mood for it every day. You ain't in the mood for a burrito every day. You know? You might have fun with you know you know you might eat pizza a week straight, but eventually you're gonna be like, damn, I'm kind of feeling something else. You know what I'm saying? That's how I am with decks. So right now, my favorite non-meta... Well, first of all, all my decks are pretty much non-meta. I mean, I'm trying to think of one that is, like, meta. But yeah, pretty much all of them are non-meta. But Like, right now, I like Spirit. I'm gonna feel like I'm in the mood to play Winged Dragon of Raw again at some point. Uh, Egyptian Gods, you know what I'm saying? Obelisk. Uh, you know... It varies. It varies. Some weird trap decks. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Shit, I was playing Gemini at one point. Um, But yeah, my favorite just varies. Cubic, obviously. Do you eat vegan pizza? Sometimes. Uh, trying to crack my back, man. Oh, I forgot this was the penguin guy. <laughs> it's been so long. It's been so long. I actually forgot he's playing penguins. This is the same guy who was playing penguins. What I do? Are you gonna do a deck with all three gods? Uh, well, good question. Let me see if that Slifer video ended up getting twenty thousand likes, like I requested. Because people think I lie about my like goals, bro. I have goals, dude. Slifer Syriax. Let's see. Let's see. I asked for 20k likes. That's 12k. Embarrassing. Embarrassing. Guess I'm never gonna do that ever in my life. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Never gonna happen. Fuck this card! I thought I was safe from this stupid whore in this deck. In a cash deck. I thought I, I thought I wouldn't have to deal with this guy. This guy is the bane of my Chaos Angels existence. Do I lose? What is the math? Oh, thank God. Oh my gosh, man. The bane of Chaos Angel's existence is this guy because despite this card being unaffected, he, Chaos Angel's only unaffected by activated effects. Nice, bro. Now you lose. Nice Max C, idiot. Ooh, I should. I just. Oh, I should just fucking. I should. No, then he. I don't do damage. Let's just grab this. Does this get destroyed? I don't even know how this works. If this card would be destroyed by card effect, banish one card from your graveyard instead. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, that doesn't matter. Uh, then I can just triple tactics talent. Oh, actually. All I got to do is play Amano Iwato. Boom. What's he going to do? Enjoy your no monster effects. Raigeki. Ooh, I could have just stole your card, too. Goodbye. You can still activate it? If only that mattered. Okay. Anyway, give me that. Sharen. Sharen. Brought to y'all. I'll be having that. Bitch. <laughs> Brought to y'all. I'll be having that. 
let me be nice that that was mean that was mean that was mean it just you know you know you just you know adrenaline flowing you know i'm saying <laughs> good duel <laughs> shake my hand <laughs> um all right quick short uh a little stream here straight to the point i got shit to do i'm trying to wake up early to go to the gym tomorrow so i am going to leave now uh sorry if that was a little abrupt but you know it was fun i do want to get to diamond i'll get to diamond next time you see me i'll probably be in diamond but uh I ain't got time for that i am leaving and uh i love you guys i love you guys though uh again goal is 1 million subscribers by the end of the month please tell somebody i know you guys are all like oh i'm already subscribed please if everyone there's 3,000 over 3,000 people in the youtube chat uh i don't know how many are on twitch right now but if everyone literally every single one of you guys tells like two people you know i'm i'm, I'm liking that math i'm liking that math that number could skyrocket anyway appreciate you guys hanging out with me uh, more streams to come again being much more active on youtube when it comes to streaming um pretty much anytime i go live on twitch i'll be live on youtube as well and uh just like no ads over here so anyway appreciate you guys hanging out seeing the spirit deck i didn't actually ever get yadagarasu off in a live duel but i showed you what it's capable of already uh but i'm leaving now goodbye i love you i'll miss you hold on did i miss any super chats super chat Nope, nope, all right. Nope, we didn't miss anything. We didn't miss anything. Did I miss any subs? I might have, I might have. I appreciate all the subs, appreciate all the bits. Thank you guys. Whoa!